Sometimes, sometimes in the van, when you make a turn. Some lights up on this dog. Hey, what's up? So Quite a few things have happened since the last video. The last one wasn't even like related. That was probably like earlier on this year. Sorry for the Arrested Development theme playing in the background. Uh, but anyways, quite a few things have happened. Well, a few little things have happened. I'm not gonna lie. I started the mini bike project and actually kind of sort of am almost done with that. Uh, along with some other things, but we'll get to that. Something like that. Jesus fuck, I was gonna say I really couldn't do any, um, I'm not even sure if I'm gonna pop on camera that much, but I couldn't do any work, cause I had to go to work. And my microphone's loose, but, you know what I guess, whatever. I can feel the mic shaking when I move it. I'm drinking coffee right now. I'm not gonna get started working on the mini bike yet. Uh, it's basically done. I'm just doing a little final touches. Let's cut this. I don't even know what the fuck I'm gonna do with this video. I just gotta work on it at some point, but this is it. It, well, as as it started as a Coleman, what, BT200X, it's this now. Uh, it has a Life in 125, which is basically like a, I don't know, fucking Honda clone. And it's a little bit of mods I had to do to it to like actually make it work. <laughs> Tank is off. That's only because there's two bars or whatever, but it really works on it. Take it on a little putter drive. It starts. It will drive. And I'm disassembling it right now. Why? Uh, just a little bit more structural support. I'm gonna redo some welds. Maybe tie it up a bit. I'm not really sure. But definitely gonna change the oil on it. Clean it up. Add a fuel filter because at the moment it's just kind of like raw dogging fuel down. Uh, and then put it back together. <clears throat> the only other update is, oh yeah, this is a trashed engine from my friend Alex's bike. I'm gonna put the fucking things out of my pocket, I can feel I'm stabbing it. It's like a Dremel. It's like a tail 110, I think. I think it's pretty dope. It's pretty reliable. It has an electric start, which is cool. Uh, does like 35 miles. It's a pretty neat little pit bike. That's a this and a half. All right, but let's get this assembling this mini bike because I don't have that much time before I have to go to work. Well, just like that, the engine's out. It took me like 10 minutes and miles to take it out. I'm gonna just, I don't know, reinforce the plate up a bit. Do the final things and then see if I can get it put back together before work time. As I go before I weld it up, I might as well just show you guys what I'm gonna do. And it's this, just a little frame if my camera would even fucking focus on it. Just a quick, simple little frame, and then I will be extending these bolts out, but I think I might have to flip the bike over to do that. You know, it's not pretty, but I just kind of needed to hold the engine in tighter. I think that works well. I'm going to sand it down, prep it up, and weld it. It's all put back together. And, um, oh wait, I'm actually getting the fuel filter. I should probably go get that, but I mean, it's all put back together. I will have to take it off to repaint it off once it's all off. And as you can see, I done off with the tensioner that I put in the back because... I'm gonna get it over and I don't think I'm gonna need it. It sits pretty stiffly in there, but let me go get that fuel filter before I forget. All right, let's see if we can toss this on real quick. Shit, bad throw. All right, let's try this again. Eh, could be better though. Boom, now that snapped in there perfectly. Well, I'm gonna start it over, turn it on and everything and take it out on a little test drive. Make sure that the chain's not gonna fall off or anything. Cause the issue I was having was the chain wasn't exactly lined up, but this looks like it might be close enough, so I'm gonna go try it out. Just I don't know right now. It's a little bit sluttery, but uh, I'm still gonna warm up just a bit. I will say the throttle is very responsive on this bike. Alright, I'm gonna go test it. Okay, so this thing right, it's perfect. It's actually a little bit sketch, but I'm gonna do the old shit because it still has the factory oil inside it and that's like not the best thing to ride around with. It's stiff, it doesn't shake as much. Gears feel weird, and adjusted the brake a bit. Yeah, yeah, Hi Draco. Hey Draco! Oh, bike's not done. You guys like my light though. It's purple. Goes good with the blue. I don't know why I'm showing it, but yeah.